Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Certainly, this is a very, very impressive venue. Quite a sight to behold. Well, there are plenty looking forward to seeing this. A capacity crowd here. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. There's the whistle, and here we go. Vestergaard. Burton. Barnes. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Kyle Walker and it's played forward and the whistle's gone presumably for offside Kasper Schmeichel sends that a long way questions were asked but he's given the answers Whistle's gone, that's a foul. It's not taken him long, and that's going to be a booking. <laughs> Leicester seem happy to let their strikers roam out wide. I wouldn't want that. Huh? No, well, my worry is that their, their main threat is being shifted out of contention. Bertrand drives it forward. Another chance from a corner. Ederson will lay claim to that. Hoists it forward. Gabriel Jesus. Oh, he's broken through. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? He's gone for it. Goal, City! The breakthrough strike. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now, that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Manchester City take the lead. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Madison. Soyuncu tries to get it forward quickly. And here's Gabriel. Sterling. That's a good ball to find him. Barnes gets rid without sophistication. That's just an example of 
over committing and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention it was vital João Cancelo De Bruyne In. Barnes Bertrand Rodri sticks in a foot to win it back oh no that's not the ball he wanted Sunchu half an hour played now hardly anything between the sides and the score is 1-0 Perez goes looking. Rodri. Sterling. De Bruyne gets it out to the wing. And he just whacks it away. Sonchu. Manchester City are ahead here. It has been a good half for them. De Bruyne gets it back. Madison. Here it comes. Barnes. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Madison. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. João Cancelo. And it's Grealish. Oh, what a wonderful stop! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. This possibly the last play of the half. Sterling has a go! Oh, and with that, the half-time whistle goes. Manchester City glad to have a one-goal lead at this point. But you have to say, things could have been very different. I'm sure they'll be very happy with their first-half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Manchester City leading 1-0 at the break. Already up and running for the second half. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. Kyle Walker. Ruben Diaz. De Bruyne. Foden. Rodri. And that's been levered clear. And here's Grealish. Real chance! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. And once more, they can't get through. Barnes. And it's Walker. Sterling. De Bruyne. And here's Grealish. It's broken loose. And here's Grealish. Defending of the desperate variety. Oh, defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Just brushed off the ball there. Now it's Vardy. Leicester showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. 
Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Has a hit! Oh, that is rather wayward. Bowden really drove at the heart of that defence. Incisive, quick, but not clinical. Kyle Walker. And here's Sterling. He's been bundled over, that is a foul. He knew what was coming, that's a yellow card. Well, not the best way to deal with it, but the, the old threat of pace clearly made him feel a tad uncomfortable. Manchester City seeking to maximise the moment. Decent hit from there. Manchester City really have been alive to interceptions and picking off any loose balls. Sanchu. Sanchu, what are you thinking? Well, the message they're sending out now is pretty loud and clear. Let's grab a second goal and, and give ourselves an element of comfort. Uh, the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Madison. Ndidi. Ndidi hits that long. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. And it's Barnes. Madison, great strength, too strong for his opponent. Grealish. Vestiga does well there, alert. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. He's gone out for a throw-in. Five minutes left on the clock. It is just a question of running down the clock now. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. And it's Barnes. Oh, good ball. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Leicester have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Forward it goes. Sterling, now it's Sterling, has a goal! They've scored! And surely that does it! Perfect time, decisive strike! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. Two up and fit. And that's that. Manchester City always looked the more driven side, probably the better side, and nobody is arguing about the result. Your reflections then, Jim. What I most admire about this outfit is the cohesion.